Okay. Uh, that was reality star Tiffany Pollard, better known as uh, New York. Yes, Yeah, and uh, her mother, Sister Patterson. Sister Patterson. Yeah. Your, your name is Sister? Sister Patterson, yes. Okay. Yeah. All right, they appear on uh, Family Therapy with Dr. Jen. Uh, also, here's my friend, my best friend, Dr. Jen. Uh, <laughs> Tiffany and Sister Patterson, you you, you don't you don't agree on, on, on whether or not you need therapy? Well, no, I know I need therapy. Um, I love my mother. She's a really great mom. But you know, I'm not gonna lie, I had a fifth of vodka to come here and deal with her today because she just gives me so many problems. I don't know how to deal with her so well, if you had a fifth, you don't need therapy. <laughs> Yeah. You need rehab. Did they have a third? Was it a third of vodka? Okay. I, I had a couple of cocktails. Okay. Do you, uh, sister, do you do you need therapy? Absolutely not. Huh? Absolutely not. I'm perfect. Tiffany needed therapy. That's why I came to the show, Dr. Jen's show, to help my daughter out. You you perfect? I'm perfect. The Bible says oh. to mark the perfect man or woman. Oh, gosh. Lord so, have mercy. I'm going to sit back. I'm going to sit back. I mean, I, I'm perfect. The Bible says what? Perfect to mark oh, the gosh. Is happening, man yeah. or woman. And so if I'm seen as perfect through the blood of Jesus. No, that ain't what that means. Oh, Lord have mercy. Well, okay. that's, that's your. Oh, you know what? You know what? I'll tell you like this. I'll tell you like this. Are you a reverend? No, I ain't no reverend. Okay, so there's, you, mi there's many oh gosh, he's got that look teachers on. and Happy. preachers and priests that expound on the word of God. It's going to mean the same thing, but they're going to say it in different ways. Okay, well, let me ask you this. What do this one mean right here? There's none perfect, no, not one. Okay. <laughs> Y'all, you know what? And if, you, and if I answer that, you have to answer, what does the Bible say when it says, mark the perfect man or woman? May I chime I'm in? Just, no, just hold tight. Okay. See, <laughs> see, it's not that I'm trying to say you're wrong about anything. No, absolutely but not. But what you can't do yes. is say you're perfect. In the, in the eyesight of God, yes, I am perfect. I am born again. I'm saved, sanctified, and filled with the precious gift of the Holy Ghost. If and Jesus Christ perfect, sees if Jesus Christ in the Spirit. Can I ask you a question? You're though? talking, yes, sweetheart. But let me get, let me make my my. Um, if the Bible says let me make my point. perfect, no, not one. You're, you're in jail. Oh, don't, don't cut me off, okay? Yeah. You're in oh. Oops. Wait. Hey, I'm getting scared. Listen. No, Steve. The Lord sees me as perfect because I am born again, and when He sees us washed in His blood, we are. How many saved or sanctified people do we have out in the audience? <laughs> that knows what Jesus Christ says. It's a lot of people know that all know that. Lord okay. it just, so, the only okay, one of them that's perfect in here is you. See, that's the only problem we have. Okay. That, we, see, that's, that's, okay. Yeah, tell okay, now hold on. Hold on. See, okay. Let's, let's get to the show because look. <laughs> Probably ain't good at this right here. Yes, you are. I, really I, I, you I, are. I ain't got no schooling for this. Okay, it, it, I'm here for you, man. I'm here for you. Okay, do you think you're too hard on your daughter? Too hard in what way, Steve? I'm just asking the question. I'm just saying. Because all the way, listen to me. I'll tell you right now. Technically, See, me, you me and you is through talking. I want to stop. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to read what's on this card right here. I'm just trying to have some type of interview with you because that's what the cards say. I, I already know. Okay. I just want to ask you that question. Do you think you're too hard on her that she can't live up to your expectations? Oh, Steve. She can't be absolutely, the person she absolutely, she wants, she absolutely, absolutely, I'm going to be on my child. It's my place as a mother to mm -hmm. lead and guide and be on her. So if, 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 if that means that it's too hard, that I'm being too hard, that's my job as a mother. I, I hard you. to deal with. Uh, how old are you now, New York? 34 years old, and I'm proud of that. Yeah, she's 34. That's good. Even she's if she was 44, I'm going to be there, Steve. She I, I, needs I mean, to go away. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. I'm Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I, I think that when 
when Tiffany is at her best and her most sober, I think Tiffany recognizes that having sex, oral or otherwise, is not what makes a woman. What makes Absolutely. a woman is her strength, her independence. But I and... want her to have a visual of seeing me. Yeah. Yeah. So she can see me as a grown woman because she thinks I'm a little ass girl. Yeah. I'm not everybody. I, I want to do what I do. Boo Tiffany, please. Boo her for that. Uh -uh. Yeah. One, two, that three. Ain't perfect. Boo. Now, I personally oh would expect, you are like, I would expect you so much more out of you. Oh, my God, you're gorgeous. Are you lusting for no, me? No, I'm not no, lusting. You know what? Okay, let's get up there. Okay. Just because, okay, wait a minute now. Wait a minute, let's back it up. Just because a woman tells a man that he's gorgeous or handsome doesn't mean that I want you. You're I'm just telling out. you a physical thing. But she, why she, gorgeous? I, I think that How she, can you not? Yes! 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 I, so. I think that the key issue with these two that they came into this house highly enmeshed. Tiffany loves her mother. Tiffany desperately wanted her mother's approval, and her mother does not approve of a lot of the choices that Tiffany's made. And as you could see, her way of delivering that information has been extremely hurtful, and some might even say abusive. And that that has been a bone of contention between these two. And one of the things that happened during this experience was Tiffany really starting to individuate from her mom. And at first, I think that was very painful for Sister Patterson. Yes, it was. And, and really kind of the two of them coming to peace with that they need to have some level of separation. Okay, folks, uh, before this gets completely out of hand, um, I'm going to go in the back and have a prayer and um, get something to drink that's brown. And then, and then we'll be right back, okay? Okay. <laughs>